Hi guys, good morning. So, I just woke up, well, not now, 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 but I, I woke up like some, like 30 minutes ago. I've had my bath, I've dressed up, um, my period just started, so I'm in that zone where I'm kind of feeling, I don't know, I don't really want human interaction today, even though, oh, this one, <coughs> take care easy. <laughs> <laughs> it's too much. Yeah, so I'm in that zone where I don't really want human interaction. I just want to be by myself and just organize, organize. That's what happens to me anytime my period starts. I don't know if anybody can relate. And I wish someone can relate. I like when I tell you guys some scenarios or some things that happen to me and you guys can relate. It makes me feel like I'm not alone in this world. <laughs> not like I ever feel like I'm alone. But anyway, I don't want human interaction. Nobody should talk to me. Nobody should to look at me. I don't, I'm not in the mood. For anybody but i don't have a choice because i promised to help me alone with some things today um yeah and it's a lot so i can't even say i'm not helping again like <laughs> the things i promised to help with is a lot so um yeah so i have to go she's come to pick me actually but before then let me just try and arrange my room i'm in that zone where i feel like just organizing and organizing everything decluttering and organizing um i started yesterday so I'm just going to try and finish up today. Um, yeah, but that's it. I'm just going to try and finish up today. Um, actually, this is my bedroom. I, I just want to organize my bedroom. If I did not have kids or if, let's say, okay, no, I, even as my kids are there, if I wasn't going out today at all, what I would have done now, because there's even lights, I would have arranged everywhere, arranged my bed, put on, you know, something to watch, have my cup of tea, take my medication, and just well i didn't stop taking medication for a very long time now but anyway just take drink my tea lie down relax and just you know enjoy my morning before my kids come back um uh, my kids these days are no longer like sophia don't grow finish you so yeah it's now almost three years with you guys sophia will be three in december like was not just yesterday that i was here laughing telling you guys how i don't go carry belly we have no plan for like it's so surprising and you know i i i now see why some people have a bunch of kids i'm not saying i want more kids so please i beg god i beg i'm not even trying i'm not even joking that kind of joke okay but i'm just saying i'm just announcing what people have a bunch of kids because as much as you know maybe either you didn't plan it or you didn't want it or you know you didn't uh it wasn't in your agenda at that time when the child is here you love the child the child is growing before you know what's happening you're out of that zone now now i'm missing having a baby i'm missing you know I'm missing that having a baby thing, right? So, not the pregnancy part though. In fact, I know I'm rambling now, but you guys should listen, okay? <laughs> In fact, I've been having this thing feeling lately of, I wish, I remember when I went to see Jenna's baby, oh my God, I felt like just carrying the baby and just look left, look right, and just run, take her home, cuddle her, play with her, you know, take care of her, and then when she's like three months or something, I take her back to her mom. But anyway, um, yeah, I, 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 I like that, as I'm missing that feeling of baby, so is it that two things? Is it that I get that feeling by you know helping other people with their kids, or I adopt kids, adopt a baby, or something like that? Adoption is out of the question for now. Okay. In fact, me and my husband are not even in that zone again. When we had just two kids, we were thinking about it, but now we're not even really in that zone again. But I know it's something that somehow, somehow is in my future, right? I don't know about that part, but the satisfy that urge of taking care of a baby, you know, baby, or I mean baby, not, not grown children, I mean like baby, baby, taking care of a baby, feeding them, bopping them, bathing them, putting them to sleep, watching them while they sleep, I have that feeling, I don't know, I miss that feeling, so, um, I, I, I don't know, maybe I should open, I thought about it several times, I've said it several times, I don't know why I'm even still saying this, when I've not made plans for it, but anyway, I feel like opening an Omogua service, where, uh, anybody that has the means to do it, please do it though. I'm not even here trying to hold information or whatever. I'm sure this idea has been dropped in many people's minds. So anyway, um, I wish I could have an Amugo service where when women give birth, I will go and just take care of them. The logistics of it now doesn't really, it's not really clear because I have smaller kids. But let's say my kids were in secondary school or something like that. Uh -uh. Like, I just drop off them in, but no, they're not going to put in school. But let's say they were in secondary school, I drop off them in school in the morning, and next thing I'm headed or whatever. Anyway, next thing I'll just head to the person's house, you know, wake them up, take care of the baby, everything, 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 and then go. Try for new moms or first time moms. Um, yeah, I wish I could do something like that. Or maybe basically run an Omogo center where I have different staff and stuff like that. Anyway. 
all this to say i need to arrange my life right now because that's the zone i'm in but let me show you guys these little things that i've done to try to kind of help me with organization one of them is changing all my hangers to one color let me show you guys i don't know if you guys can see uh -huh. so i changed all my hangers to black i changed all my hangers to black yeah yeah so i changed all my hangers to black and not only are they black they are the same type of hanger um only in my wardrobe anyway in my in every other person's wardrobe i just i i'm, I'm not bothered like they have different colors of hangers, different types of hangers. It, it, they are not bothered by it, so if they like it, I love it, okay? But me, it used to bother me a lot. I like uniformity, at least when it comes to the hangers. When it comes to the clothes, you can't do anything about it, but at least you can, you can make your hangers uniform. So, I just removed all the colorful hangers I had and everything, and now bought, like, black hangers. Some of them, there are two types anyway, but they are very, very similar. One is the, I got that one this is from one store here, but it's, it's Ikea hangers, right? So it's just slim, black, sleek, nothing to it, Ikea hangers. Then the other set, which is like 20 of them, they are the foldable hangers that you can travel with. So um, they look similar. So I bought more of the foldable hangers so that anytime I want to travel, I can just travel with them. And you know, when I'm here, I use them as well. They have one look like this, where they fold them, where it makes it easy to hang dresses, okay? Let me just arrange my room, shall I? My room is actually messy. Um, well, not that messy. Just arrange my bed, pack all those things inside the Ghana must go. There are some clothes I was looking at. And then, I will be good to go. You look at me like I'm crazy. When I shut my feelings out You look at me like I'm different Still you stay cause you feel something real Get so lost in my moments Doesn't mean I don't need you I, 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 I fell in love with your colors They kinda tell me what I'm thinking I fell in love with the way we are and the way we lose it There's something different about us And the reason why we stay Stay We fly around like paper planes They never know where we will fall Nobody can see us Still they wanna tear us apart There's something different about the way we are Uh, yeah, so you guys were watching Super Mario today is Friday and the kids are awake and they are happy. <laughs> Sophia, Sophie. <laughs> Sophia, 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 this one once is watching it, she just enter. Are you happy? You like it? Sophia, you like it? Are you happy? Yes, yes. <laughs> yeah. But this is our movie night without popcorn. That's true. It's not complete. Yeah. We don't really like it. Mm. And, uh... Oh, Sophia. Alright, so let's start. One, right like this. And down. Two. Ready? Are you ready? 
good, good, good. So let's go. One, two, go. Very well. Keep set. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, so we are going the other way. We're also doing another thing. Mm -hmm. Sophia, you ready? Good. So let's go. One, two, three. Thank you. 